Hey, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're all doing really well. So, I feel really good there because I've got another job lot. Honestly, can't contain myself. <sighs> I feel a bit uncomfortable that I've like put it on my bed, especially my new bed in, you know, but whatever, I'm just gonna crack on with it. This is my favorite type of video to do. They make me so happy. Like, I feel really giddy, honestly. Like, my cheeks are hurting because I'm just like, I want to get in there. Um, so yeah, I need to calm down, honestly. I'm in a hot flush. I see a little bit of hair sticking up in the viewfinder. Don't mind that. That's my inner pineapple trying to get out. I don't know what I'm doing with my hair today. I've just banged it up. You know, I fancied it. So if you haven't seen this type of video before on my channel, where you been? I'll stick a few previous ones in the description box um, for you to have a look at. Basically, it's just me buying a load of old shit off Facebook. Love buying car boot bundles, job lots, anything that I don't know what's in there. Love the element of surprise. It makes me happy, so, you know. And sometimes you can get a bargain, so, you know, don't knock it, people. I should be a market trader. I love wheeling and dealing and stuff. I'm a bit handsy today as well. I'm a bit like throwing fingers at you. <laughs> yeah, I'm just, I feel really excited. Can you tell? If you think you'll like this kind of video, don't forget to hit like, look, my hands have come up again. I don't know what my problem is. If you think you'll like this kind of video, don't forget to hit like and subscribe, genuinely means a lot. If you wanna follow me on Instagram, it's fayj202. I'll link it below. Um, yeah, keep on watching. So this time the bundle cost eight quid for two big bags. Like they're very heavy, like, I'm excited. Eight quid, like what's eight quid? I spend that in scratch cards, I do. I'm not promoting gambling people, I never win. I actually get quite madder. I don't know why I put myself through it. But you know, eight quid, I thought oh, I'll have a go on that. There were no pictures or anything. It was just a brief description saying there was like a mixture in there um, of over 20 items. So I thought, yeah, I've gotta have that. Gotta have that for eight quid. Ugh, this is bag number one. It's very, very heavy and very full. It's really heavy and a cushion. I do love cushions and you know, I'm in need of one at the minute about this size. This one feels like it could just be more clothing. I hope not. The first thing on top though, I haven't seen what's inside these bags by the way. I got Steve to like collect it and stuff and stick it in the boot and hide it. This is a brand new top from Next. Oh my God, it's got a 15 quid price tag on. It's a little top here. Is this one of them like peplum tops? Like, it smells new. It smells new. Like, Oh my God, that says 15 quid on it. Can you believe it? I mean, I'm not really a fan of it. Like if I was to put it against me, it's in my size. What are the chances of that? But it's not really my cup of tea. Like I like the colors, but oh, I don't know. I can't believe that, 15 quid, eh? We're off to a good start, people, a good start. We've got a coat. Oh my God, this is a coat. How decent. It's from Next again, look at that, that's from Next. Look at that, that's from Next. Oh my God, what a pretty coat. What age is this? Nine to 10, oh my God, this is a quality coat, people. This is quality, like, honestly. Why are people selling things so cheap? This person, to be fair, is regularly selling bundles. Maybe it's just stuff they can't get rid of now. I can't believe it. I mean, it's got a name in there, Chardonnay. What a beautiful name, Chardonnay, I love that. I can't believe it. This is a proper decent coat. I'm actually in shock. I could make more than eight quid on these two bits alone. And <laughs> then, I just nearly snotted. Um, it's a massive bottle of flora. I can't believe it. Just use it, honestly. Just clean your kitchen off something. Maybe they don't like Zaflora, fair point. Maybe they don't like it. The next thing is another coat. Oh my God, this is 11 to 12. This will fit my Tyler, this will. What a bargain. I'm sure that's Primark, I think so. Oh my God, it's like a little raincoat. Like it's a nice lightweight one, 11 to 12. As if, as if, look at that. That is proper nice. There's no marks on it, no rips, no nothing. I mean, there's, there's a little mark there. Nothing a hot wash will sort out. As if, honestly. I mean, to be fair, I like manky old car boot bundles, but I'm not mad at these, you know? I honestly don't know what I'm buying when I go for them. Um, I just know that it's a car boot bundle. So I like the manky old ones, you know? But I am not complaining at everything so far in this bundle. I'm honestly so chuffed. We have a little pair of sandals. These are in decent condition. I'm sure we had a pair of sandals in one of the previous ones as well. I think this car boot bundle is somebody just getting rid of like all their stuff, but it's decent. Like if they actually went to a car boot and sold it, they would have got some decent money like car boots when i were younger like growing up going around with my mom and my nan and stuff like things were like 20p so literally you could have a quid and you'd come home with quite a few bits but nowadays like you'll say oh how much is that and they'll be like 10 pounds and i'll be like say what for a peg oh look at those little cute sandals they're really cute they're from george that's asda isn't it oh they're really cute you know <sighs> 
They're very cute. Right. Next thing that I can see in this bag makes me very, very happy because I am in need. I have been after a pair of curtains in this colour for so long. Do you know what? A while back, me and Big Steve went to a charity shop and we was having a wander around and I seen these exact curtains. These exact curtains. And they were like a fiver and I didn't have a fiver on me and I was gutted. And the next time I went back, they were gone. And then I've just found them in this bundle. Can you believe it? Where are they from? Do they're from Dunelm, ain't they? They're from Dunelm. Look at that. I've nabbed a pair of curtains from Dunelm. Oh my God, I've never had out from Dunelm. <laughs> oh my God, look at them. Like this is what I need in my lounge. I've been after some beigey colored curtains for ages. Oh my God, they're really long as well. Like they're really long. Look at that. <sighs> I'd have paid her a tenner for these on their own. Oh my God, I feel like I ripped her off. <sighs> I've just chucked my hair back because I've got a sweat on out of excitement, honestly. So I probably look like a twat. It's like, yeah, I've just bunged it back. I'm so happy. I feel like messaging and saying, what, what are you doing? <laughs> honestly, like they're lined as well. And they're these ring top ones. I can't be doing with them little plastic things. I just can't. I've got hair. I go, oh, it's my moustache. That ain't going nowhere. <laughs> Prefer to get these. You know, I like an easy life. Seriously though, I have never felt so excited over a pair of curtains. The fact that I've been after these ones for ages as well, and then like going in the charity shop and not being able to get them, like they were exactly the same as these. I don't think they're from Dunelm. Like really hyping up Dunelm, but like growing up, that was a bit of a posh shop. Last thing in here, I think is some bedding. That's quite handy actually. They've put the bedding in the pillowcase. I quite like that. Let's have a look. I've never really had second hand bedding, but I, I wouldn't knock it, I guess. I really like it actually. It's quite pretty and it's quite like an autumny colour, isn't it? I don't really have like second hand bedding. I haven't really bought that before, but I mean, you know, nothing a hot wash will sort out. You just never know what people have got up to, do you? You know, a bit of the old anky panker. It's not bad. It's not bad. That's the end of bag one and I actually can not believe, I can't believe it. Everything that I've got, like, it's them curtains, it's the curtains for me. I feel like I've really done her over, like I feel really bad. She does sell like lots of bundles all the time. Cause I would really feel bad if it was somebody like really skint trying to get rid of their stuff like for cheap, that would like break my heart. Like I, I mean, I'd rather just give someone 20 quid like and keep your stuff, do you know what I mean? But the fact that they're regular sellers, you know, I don't feel as bad. I feel like I've grabbed a bloody bargain. I also got a cushion in there as well, which to be honest, I'm really happy about because Big Steve's got these pillowcases and we haven't got any like inserts for them. I did find one for it. So I managed to put it in here, which is a Harley Quinn pillowcase. Then I need two more. So I've got that one, which I need to put in. And then there's this one which is like all horror characters. Cause we do love a bit of horror, you know, we love horror. Yeah, I think that'll fit perfect in there. Just take this manky old purple one off. The next bag is a big old black bag. It feels very heavy and I don't know what's in there. And that excites the hell out of me, honestly. First thing in this bag is this. It's a little Chad Valley. Chad Valley is quite good for like kids toys. The handle bits come off, but they just slot back in. They're not slotted in properly. I'm having all kinds of problems. It's a little bubble blower one as well. Like that you push around the garden or around the house or whatever. I always let the kids in the house with bubbles and stuff. It's got a little on off button. So it need batteries? Yeah, it does. It needs batteries. Oh, but this is dead good. Oh, I love it. I absolutely love it. I mean, how much is that on its own? Let's have a look. I am really struggling with these nails, by the way. Like, I love false nails, but I can't do anything. My lashes, this one isn't even on properly, if you haven't already noticed. I hope no one's connected me to the telly, honestly, because you'll be able to see it really bad. Um... You know, on the phone though, you can't really see it like that. So I hope anybody watching this video is doing it on a phone. Um, but I can't do anything. And I opened the window last night and trapped my thumb and I felt like my whole actual nail underneath was gonna rip off as well. And you know, it brought a tear or two to my eye. Quite upset. Chad Valley bubble machine, bubble lawn mower. It's a Chad tenor. That's a tenor. Look at that. That's a tenor on its own. Oh my God. That's a tenor. I mean, on eBay, 16.99. But you go, oh gosh, that's a tenner. I've got another cushion. <gasps> I've completed the set. Oh my God. So I've got enough cushions now. I've got enough cushions and cases. Oh. It's the little things, people. It's the little things. This is the best eight quid I think I've ever spent. I mean, I might have had a kebab here or there. That's come very close. But this, this, Next thing I've got is, oh, look at that. 
that that's a little dress that is a little dress and this is from Mon monsoon oh my god monsoon eh who shops at monsoon i mean monsoon i walk past it it's not really my attire you know but it's bloody expensive you know that's pretty that is and that is age seven to eight. Oh, i love it it's so cute what is this one <sighs> look at this how lovely is this it's a little dress a little dress and it is it doesn't say the age actually it doesn't say but you know probably about five or six i bet bloody love the colors hence the lipstick today you know i just fancied it thought i'm always on them nudes you know spice it up a little bit i love that that is so adorable that it is so adorable oh, it, it really is hey what's this oh it's a little summer top Look at that. I wish they were clothes in my size though. Oh, that's a cute little top. That is so cute. Got another one here. Oh, this is a bit more, this is a knitted one. So it's a bit more autumn feels. It's a little navy dress. Oh, it's from Next. Little cute dress. This is a nice little knitted one. 11 to 12. 11 to 12, really? I'd have said about an eight year old. I love kids clothes, I do. Not in a weird way, like, you know. I don't know what this is. What is that? Anyone know what that is? Optimised viewing angle, clear view standing cover. I haven't got a clue. There's another phone case in here. Um, I don't know what one this is for. I can't even get in. It's these nails, I can't get in it. Thought it was a phone at first, you know, when I'd seen that. I was gonna have to message her and say, you love your phone, love. But no, it's just like a sticker with like the time on. We have some shorts. There's a lot of clothing in this set. And um, these are a size small. Big Steve won't get in there. <laughs> Bloody hell, come next. They're in a size small, they're quite nice. They're just not gonna fit any of us. Next few bits in this little bundle are some DVDs. I'm sure we had DVDs before as well. Um, surf's up. These are like brand new. They've not even been opened. Got a PlayStation game, check that out. PlayStation 4 game. Oh, I wonder if Steve will play that. I don't know if he will. Black Ops, Call of Duty Black Ops. Open season, that's brand new as well. Um, Oh, a bit of ASMR there with all that crinkly stuff. You know, close your eyes, you fall asleep to that. Well, I do anyway. Do you know what? ASMR, you know, I used to think, oh, I don't know if I'd be into that. Now it's a way of life, honestly. This is music and lyrics. It's got Hugh Grant and Drew Barrymore in. I love Drew Barrymore. Um, and Garfield. Garfield the movie. Like, oh my God. Bargains. They have some men's trainers as well, and they're not in bad condition. Like, they've got really good soles on them. Um, they're nice and clean and stuff. They're actually in really good condition. Like, they just need a little bit of a wipe, um, which I've sort out. Do you know what comes to mind with, like, these and stuff? Like, I would really love to give to, like, a homeless shelter. But where I live, they're so far away. Maybe I could send them in the post to a homeless shelter. I don't know. Especially, like, with autumn and winter and stuff. Like, what am I going to do with things like this? So, yeah, I think I'll give them a ring and see if I can send them some stuff. I just think somebody else could, like, benefit from bits like that more than we can. Um, so, that's what I'm going to do. Right, what else have we got in here? Oh, we've got some more toys. What are these? This is my dance move, by the way. This is, like, what I do all the time. It's my go-to move. Got to have your shoulders back and you just, you know, you pump. I don't know what the face is. We have some more curtains. Oh, these are quite nice. From Next. They're from Next, aren't they? They're not my cup of tea, but they're quite nice. Actually, I think these might go in my lounge, you know? I don't know. They're not my cup of tea. Like, I love my beige ones from Dunelm. I am down to my last item from this job lot, and it's a little alarm clock, I think. A little alarm clock. Do you know what? This is gonna come in handy. Because you know when I'm doing a scoring in the morning, sometimes I sleep through my alarm. Like, we're doing night shifts. Like it absolutely KOs me. So if I've like finished a night shift and come home and I go to bed as normal, the next morning it's very hard for me to wake up. And I have been known to miss the school run and the kids have arrived at school at like 11 o'clock. Um, I've also been known <laughs> before to forget about lunch. And <laughs> especially on school trips, you know, I forgot before and the teachers have had to like give like a spare pack lunch or they've rang me and said you know you forgot a pack lunch and i'll go to pick the kids up from school and they'll be like you forgot my pack lunch i mean i, I mean it's bad but it does make me laugh 
thinking back, I'm not a knob, I'm not. These are just things that happen in life, aren't they? Still bloody ticking away. Still got his batteries in. That is the end of the video. And I have to say that is the best eight quid I've ever spent. Like I love doing these bundles. Like the next bundle I do, I kind of want it to be a bit of like a dirty one, a dirty car boot bundle. Like really old stuff. Like that would make me happy, but I'm not mad at this. I'm not mad at this bundle at all. Like eight quid advertised as a car boot bundle. Come get it, you know? I was like, yes, I'll give it a go. Please leave a like and subscribe if you did, that would mean a lot. Also, if you could like share it on your social medias, like Facebook, things like that, that would mean a lot. I've got a giveaway coming up very soon as well. So keep your eyes peeled for that. Um, if you want to follow me on Instagram, it's fayj202. I'll link it below. I just post absolute shy all day on Instagram. <laughs> Honestly, I'm just like do 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 post. But yeah, I hope you're alright. I've got a right sweat on. It's the excitement, honestly. I hope whatever you're doing, wherever you are in the world right now, you're having a great day or evening, and I'll see you in my next video.